It certainly was, Steve. Um, to finish a game 36-14 and to have, uh, for the last 20 to 22 minutes, um, eight academy players in the critical positions, um, halfback, 5-8, uh, loose forward and, and hooker, uh, was, was pleasing, but particularly pleasing for um, the senior players, particularly in that first half. Players like Brad Dwyer, uh, Toby Everett, John Wallace, Harvey Burnett, um, all got some magnificent touches and I thought were really, really um, good in the game. I always um, had it in my mind that um, there would be a combination of um, academy and first team players for the first 40, 50 minutes, but the last 20, 25 minutes I was going to put all the uh, academy team. So essentially it was a, the last 20 minutes was an academy trial against the Scholars. I think um, the, 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 the one that came uh, to mind was um, um, Ollie Toms on the um, on the edge, who defended very very well, and he had an opportunity um, to run and create some opportunities with his offence. Um, but otherwise, all of them were um, went really really well. Their aggression and their defence and their tackle technique was probably the most pleasing thing. Yeah, we defended uh, nine sets on our line. Uh, nine sets within five metres and conceded one try at the back end of that last 25 minutes in the second half. So, uh, it, it, again, Steve, it's uh, it's quite pleasing to um, or refreshing that what we've been doing in the uh, pre-season has come to fruition. So we're going to get it better and obviously uh, when we go into Dewsbury uh, this week we'll have our um, um, top 13 side available and some of those players that, that played tonight uh, may be in the mix of 18 to 20, uh, the top 20.